hi guys um it's saturday um it's seven o'clock it seems so much later i hate this um time change thing um it makes me tired earlier and we actually got to sleep in late today um i think it was like 9 30 that we woke up my husband was off today he's usually um he usually works on saturdays but he was off today and he's off tomorrow so we got to sleep in but um, anyway, um, so it's Saturday. Um, I did some some shopping at um, at Joann's, and I actually didn't know that they had all their scrapbooking stuff for forty percent off until we got there because um, I don't know where we went that was by there, and I asked my husband like, oh, let's go to Joann's, and so we did, and they happened to have all their scrapbooking stuff for forty percent off. And um, for some reason, I don't know if maybe they're like restocking or they're getting new stuff in or something, but their aisle that has the stickers, well, like it's like the aisle and they have stickers on both sides, was like empty. Like there was a lot of stuff missing and I don't know, if, I don't know when the sale started. Let me see. I don't know. I don't know if maybe they had just ran out of stuff already or, but it was like pretty, pretty cleaned out. But anyway, there was really nothing that I wanted. I couldn't find anything that I wanted. Um, so I just got uh, a few stickers. I got these um, Tim Holtz. They're like those little... I know I've seen a lot of people um, show these, so I'm not going to show them. But um, yeah, so I got these. And I don't know how much these were. They have a lot of... There's like one... There's three sheets in white and three sheets in craft. It doesn't say how many there are. And I don't know. Let me see how much these were. Mm, $4.99, so they were $2.99 at 40% off. And then I got these tiny text, Cosmo Cricut tiny text um, with Christmas words. And I'm not sure if I have these. I might have them, but I wasn't sure. So I went ahead and got them anyway because I want to use them in my December daily and just in case I didn't have them this was the only one there too and these were a dollar 49 and they were 89 cents so I got that and then these I had seen last time and um, they only had these three I wish they had more in this this black one they're also the Cosmo Crooked tiny type but they're just numbers because I was noticing um, I don't know if I've shown you all the, they're like, um, what are they? Recollections. The Recollections um, stickers, alpha stickers from Michaels. Um, and I use them a lot in my Project Life stuff. And I'm always running out of the numbers because I put the date on most of the pages. I'll put the date and I use those stickers a lot. And I was thinking like, I wish they had like stickers that were just like numbers so that I wouldn't like waste all the numbers and like have all these I have like four or five packs open and I have like all the letters but I'm missing a lot of the numbers and so these are all just numbers hold on I'll, let me do it one at a time so yeah they're all and I like the font oh it's the same thing twice and that's a lot of numbers it doesn't say Oh, it says 373 stickers. That's a lot of stickers for 89 cents. And so I got two of the black ones, and then I got these. And, oh, I don't know if it, it has words on the bottom. Oh, and it has months. Oh, those are cool. And then I got them in, in this, like, cream color. And I, I think they only had one of this, which is why I only got one. And then they had some clear ones, but... I didn't want the clear ones. So I got those, and those were 89 cents. And then, oh, and then I got these. These are Heidi Grace. And I love alphabet stickers. And these are just black. And I like the font. I especially like the lowercase font. And it, I like that it has, like, those little hearts and stuff. And um, I'm going to open these because it says, it says it has 852 stickers. So you really can't tell just by looking at the package. Um, how many sheets are in here? 
so I'm going to open this and see. And these were mm, $5.99, so they were $3.59. Hold on, I don't want to poke myself with this. One of the staples came off. I'm filming in my in our bedroom, so I hope it's not too dark. I don't know, I, I keep sounding like, I, I notice every time I do my videos, like at the end of the day, I'm kind of like, ugh, and I like lose my train of thought, and I seem like all, like drained. I can't get this out. So I apologize if I'm boring you all. Oh, wow. Okay. This has one, two, three, four, five, six sheets. They're all exactly the same, but it has six sheets. And I really like these because I don't know if I said it already. They're, um, they're cardstock. So they're not like the flimsy, um, like paper, um, letters. They're cardstock. I love, that was definitely worth, what did I say these were? Three fifty nine for six. That's pretty good. So I'm not gonna put those back in because it takes too long. I mean, not right now. So I got that. That was all I got at Joann's, and there was a lot of people at Joann's. Like I waited in line for I don't know. It seemed like a long time. I think I waited in line longer than than I looked around the store. And oh wait, where's that thing? I was looking at this. They stuck this in my bag, and this is for um, Tuesday. November the 13th through the 21st and it's I I don't know what this is maybe I've never heard of this before maybe y'all have um it's called Mary Mula and um this is five dollars off your purchase of twenty five to fifty dollars ten dollars off your purchase is that Black Friday when is Black Friday maybe this is a Black Friday sale it's like say five dollars off and then ten dollars off and fifteen dollars off and then it's got some stuff back here. Oh, it says Daily Doorbuster. So maybe this is. I don't even know when when Black Friday is. Like on Wednesday, November the 21st, they're going to have um, the 12 by 12 paper stacks for $8.99. The ones that are regular, $19.99. So that's 55% off. That They didn't have any paper that I wanted either. Okay, then I went to Michael's, and um, my sister had told me, um, my sister was here earlier this morning, and she told me that um, um, she had gone to Michael's, or one of her Michael, um, one of her Michael's, because <laughs> she owns a Michael's, um, um, some Michael's, I, I don't know if she told me which one, and that um, they have some recollections stuff that's like similar to the Smashbook stuff, and she, I think she actually told me I don't know how she knew that though. That recollection stuff is going 40% off or half off starting tomorrow because she said she was going to get washi tape or something. But anyway, so this Michaels that I went to had this stuff and it's so awesome. I only got a couple of things and I didn't want to wait because I, I'm sure I won't get to go to Michaels during the week and it won't be till next weekend. And hopefully I'm going to go back and get some more stuff. But anyway. Um, they had, um, well, let me show you what I got. And I'm going to open this because since this is new stuff, I'm sure nobody has really shown this, like, in in detail. Yeah, but they had a lot of cool stuff. They had, like, um, the books. And I think the books were $12.99. And they had, like, um, the smaller ones. I don't know what the size of the small Smash books, the Kane Co. ones are. But they had one... Two, I think they have four or five different styles of the small ones, and I only liked one. It was so pretty. I, I want to go back and get it. Um, and the, it has like um like the the sheet, and it's not it's not like the smash books, like the Kane Close smash books have the um what do you call that thing? Like the spiral and the sheets are in there. It's like a a a, a three ring binder, and so it has like the different sheets in there, but um. So, like, you can open it and take stuff out or move it around or... But anyway, I'll talk about that a little bit more in a minute. But this is, um... It's this journaling cardstock paper pad. And it just has little, um... Um... My gosh, I don't have words. Like, the little, um, cards and stuff, like, for Project Life. And this has 30 sheets. And I think these were... Where's my receipt? 
Uh, here it is. Hold on. These were two ninety nine, so oh, forty percent off of that would have been a good deal. But anyway, I got this, and it has like, like the little cards. I love that little owl, Emily. Look at the little owl. He's got glasses. And I know the color sucks, and I don't know what those lines are. I think it's because of the ceiling fan. Oh, it's got two of each. And then it's got this one. I love that camera. Oops. And then the one with the bike. The color in here looks crappy. Sorry, guys. This, um, my husband and the kids are in the living room. That one has, like, little banners, and that one is, <laughs> you can hear my husband with his crazy laugh that my sister loves. Just kidding, she she hates it when he laughs like that. He does this loud. Oh, look at this one! Look, Emily, it has a mustache. And this has, that looks like a little, is this a punch out? No. That looks like a little Polaroid with, with banners. I hope this video is not too long. I do want to show this to y'all though, so y'all can check it out at Michael's if if y'all like it. So it has a lot of things you can cut them apart and make like little cards. That one has like notebook paper and that one's just like a little card. There's that. And so there's two of each. I know I said that already, right? Okay, this one's just like, this one's a four by six. Look at that cute little bike with the hearts. I love that. And then there's this one. Oh, love this one. Love the banner. That frame is really cute. This makes me think of Studio Calico. There's that one with the little bird. And that. What are those lines? I see lines on my screen. There's that. Oh, these are, look, you can cut these. These are in, in fours. That's tiny. What would you do with that? I really like this one. And this one has, there's a little speech bubble. These make me think of the L Studio um, stamps. Okay, now was it. So these were, what did I say? These were $2.99. So 40, I can't do the math in my head. $4.99. I mean, 40% off of $2.99. That would be pretty good. And then I got this thing. And this is, this says Basic Solids Card Stop Paper Pad. And this was this was seven ninety nine I think yeah this was seven ninety nine and I know and I mean that seems like a lot but I really wanted this because I have some ideas for this I'm not going to use it for for like that book or whatever I have some something I want to do with this but um I'm taking the little thingies off so I can open it and show y'all I hope I'm not talking too low either. I don't know why pads have these sticky things. I hate them. And this is, what size is this? Six and a half by 8.8 .8 inches. That's a weird size. <laughs> My husband's making that laughing again. Okay, and the thing with these that, that I liked about it, it's, um, let me open it. Let me show y'all. It has the whole down the side so you can put them in the in the binder thingy the smash book thing so it has the holds but you're probably not going to be able to oh my god it looks so crappy in here I'm sorry um, you can't see it but it's like um, it's not a paper like a flat paper finish it's like a I want to say glossy but it's not um, not glossy like um, like the paper that has the glossy stuff. It's kind of like uh, I'm trying to think. Oh, okay, like um, 
Um, Joann's has Heidi Grace, um, packs of Heidi Grace die cuts and stuff like that, and they're not paper. They've got like that, um, like that coating on them. That's what this, this has. Oh, look, you can kind of see there, it's like kind of, you can see the glare because it wouldn't do that on flat paper. And that's why I like them. I don't know why, because what I want to use these for, um, I'm going to cut like, oh, let me show you what the patterns are. Well, you probably can't even see because it's so dark. I'm just going to flip through it real quick. Like it's got that um, chevron and that's like some orange. I can't even tell what it is because I'm looking in the, in the at the computer screen and I can't see the pattern. Oh, there's a red chevron. There's that funky pattern. That looks like red. There's another chevron. Oh, I oh that's a bonus. Look like that. That one right there. This one up top is a pink chev chevron. Yeah, but the back is a different color. I love that. That makes it even better. I'm going to go faster. I think that's, oh no, that's a different one. I was going to say that, um, oh my God, my face looks orange. Is it because of the, it's because of the paper. Um, the pattern started repeating, but no, I don't think it has yet. Yet yeah, now I think it, now I think it did. Anyway, um, there's all these. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut like, um, like close to the, oh, where's the, over here, I'm going to cut like close to the holes and I'm going to try to make like a little file folder type thing and I'm going to make a little, um, a little album, like a mini file folder album, like the one that, um, Emily's working on with the Heidi Swap, um, folders. That's what I wanted it for. I'm going to try to do that with these. But anyway, so these, I guess, are the pages that you buy. If you want to buy extra pages for those, um, oh, and this is what the front looks like. For the Smash books, the Recollections one. But um, inside the actual book, the paper, the pages are like paper. They're not like this um, shiny stuff. Um, so I don't know if these are like for pages or their dividers. I'd say they're pages because they did, they had, um, now I'm going to tell you all what they had. They had this and this was the only one that they had. Uh, it wasn't like a different, uh, pack or whatever. They only had this one. Then they had, um, some like, um, tabbed dividers. Um, but they were like, uh, not acetate. Um, what, what, what am I thinking of? Like a transparency and they were printed but they were thick. They weren't like thin, like a transparency. There was like some thickness to it. And I want to say it was like a pack of five and they were like $3.99 or $4.99. So they had those. And then they had like little packs of, um, they had uh, a pack of little craft envelopes, um, like with a Chevron print. And then they had, um, several of these, um, like different, um, styles and whatever. I think they had this one and then they had another one, like a colorful one like this. And then they had one that was, um, on craft paper with like black print. And that was really cute. And then they had, um, what else did they have? Did I say they had envelopes? Oh, they had some pockets, a little pack of, um, like pockets, like coin looking envelopes and stuff like that. Oh my God, did you hear my husband just burp? Sorry. Um, what else did they have? They had a whole bunch of stuff. Um, Y'all should go check it out. There he, he did it again. Um, yeah, so they had a lot of cool stuff. And um, the Hello Kitty stuff. They also had the Hello Kitty stuff, which I looked at and I didn't really... I like Hello Kitty, but that's just like too much Hello Kitty. They had a paper pad and every sheet of paper had Hello Kitty and I didn't like it. Um, but anyway, yeah, so, um, if stuff goes 40% off this week, I'm going to try to go on Saturday and get some more of the stuff and hopefully get the, the book. Um, but anyway, so that was all I bought today. And then I'm going to show y'all real quick some pages that I did, um, yesterday or day before yesterday. I can't remember. Um, 
this was this was all me i usually like lift most of the pages that i do but this one i came up with on my own and um, this little where is it this little tab right here i used my mcgill um file punch and i don't know if you can see that little heart i punched it out and um the reason i did it it made me think of um there's some studio calico tab stamps that have um like the little negative it's like a heart and i think it's a star and i don't know what the other ones are and i was like oh if i have a little heart punch i can make a, a tab and then punch a little um heart out of it and i made some um i punched some out for emily um to send her and i did um some with a little heart and some with a little star because i also have a little star punch but anyway so um i just layered some papers there and this this right here is actually like um that lined paper right here and it's like underneath that bird washi is from one of the um we are memory keepers um little what are those things called from the albums made easy that i got at target that's actually what that is and then um i just put some what is this oh this is a piece of um everyday eclectic uh, sticker like a border sticker that I think I put right there and then right here at the bottom there's everyday eclectic paper sticking out right there and right here and what else well there's that bird washi and then I kind of just did like a little cluster right there with the bird washi and um, that arrow is a sticker from everyday eclectic and that pattern paper underneath is also and that capture the moment is from one of the everyday eclectic uh, printables that I got off of Jessica Sprague and then I just put those two little um, pearl dot thingies and that little heart I think this little heart was what I punched out from from up here and so I just put that down there and so that was one of them and then this was this was a lift off of um, Sasha Farina um, uh, I want to say her blog is sashafarina.com, but I could be wrong. But um, I know I have her on my friend's um, list on Facebook. But I'm sure I'm sure if you do like a um, a search for Sasha Farina blog, her blog will come up. And I just love her stuff. So this was a lift off of her um, one of her pages. Um, not exactly, but I'm sure if you saw hers and you saw mine, you'd see where where I got, um, that I got the idea from her. But anyway, this is, um, a little, um, speech bubble, like, die cut or laser cut thing that I got off of Big Cartel, and I misted it with, uh, Delusion Spray, as well as a doily. Where's the doily? That was a white doily, and I misted it, and I love the way it looked, and now I want to do, um, a whole bunch of different colors, uh, of doilies with my Delusion Sprays. Um, where's the letters? These letters are um, Simple Stories Snap from the Snap Collection. Um, this ampersand is from the Heyday um, Ephemera Pack. Um, this, what is that? I think I used, I had something else that was an arrow and I traced it and cut that out of, I think, I really don't know what that paper is, but this paper with the letters is a, uh, Crate Storyteller, and um, there's the the Simple Stories letters again, and then that little heart, where is it? The red heart, wherever the red heart is, there it is, um, is a punch out. Oh my god, my husband keeps burping. We made, um, I made uh, chalupas. I don't know if all of y'all know what chalupas are. It's like a, like a, what do you call it? Like a shell, like a circle, like a flat shell. And then we put like refried beans and ground beef and um, tomatoes on top. And then I made um, rice and um, beans on the side. So it's probably why he keeps burping. He's gassy. Guess who's sleeping on the couch? Just kidding. Um, I'm sure he'll fall asleep on the couch anyway. Um, this banner right here is um, also from the Heyday Ephemera pack. And I cut it because it was longer. And this little thing right here that says whatever it says 
is um that's all creative imaginations it's like a 12 by 12 sticker sheet with a whole bunch of sayings and stuff and then this paper peeking out at the bottom is also great storyteller and i've had this paper like forever and I just used it and actually I think this um, this paper right here isn't even from the collection it's, it's from the 6x6 six six pad from um, from Michael's that um, my friend Virginia gave me for our swap and um, I think that's everything oh and this little striped paper right here is also great storyteller well it's recollections but I mean it's really great and that was a picture of Mikey. I know I posted it on Facebook. Mikey and Max. And Max was playing uh, in the front yard. And he loves to lay like that. I don't know why he does it. And he's done it ever since he was a puppy. And somebody else told me their, their dog does it. But I don't remember who. But he loves to lay like that on his belly. And I think it's so cute. And so it says a boy and, and his dog. And so anyway. So that was... That was um, a couple of pages that I did, and um, for the past couple of years, I try to do, like, at least 100 pages um, for the year, and I think that puts me at 85, so I have all of, well, what's left of this month, and then December to do 15 pages. I don't know if that'll happen or not, but if it does, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't. My throat kind of hurt. My camera froze. Okay, there it goes. My hair, I did not do anything to my hair today. It looks kind of wavy, and I told my husband, I was like, I'm not going to do anything to my hair. Does my hair look okay? And he's like, yes, it does. But I think he just didn't want me to take the time to dry it or flat iron it or whatever. But anyway, so that was all I did today. That was, oh my god, my camera froze again, and I looked so scary. I was like, oh, frozen like that. Anyway, um... That was all I did today. Just did some shopping and then we came home. Oh, we did our grocery shopping. Came home, ate dinner, and it's only 7.30. I don't like this time change. It makes the days seem like so long. But anyway, um, Emily, I went to the post office today and I mailed your box. And um, who am I thinking of? Who am I? Cindy from the scrapyard. I also mailed your package, so you should be getting your butterflies sometime this week um i forgot monday was a holiday so emily you'll probably get your i know she told me i didn't pay attention to when she told me it was going to get there um but i do have the delivery confirmation number so i'll message you that later and oh my god the post office was crazy busy and thankfully we made it um in time before the actual um inside of the post office closed because I hate using that automated machine they have because I don't ever know like for sure if I'm doing it right or not. And so I was in the line for the machine and then I decided to go in since it was still open. But there was like a ton of people. I think I waited in line for like a good 30 minutes. And there was a lady, like four people in front of me who had a whole bunch of boxes. I don't know what was in them. But they were like pretty big boxes and she ended up spending like $100 to ship everything out. I was like, wow, that's crazy. But anyway, so I hope y'all have had a good Saturday. I'm probably going to go sit in the living room and watch a movie with the kids and Miguel. So I hope y'all had a good day. And um, y'all should definitely go and check that stuff out um, if y'all like smash books and stuff like that. They, ha they were really cute. I looked at a couple of the books. No, I think I looked at all of them. And there was only one that I really liked, but there's a lot of different, um, stuff that, different styles and stuff, but anyway, so I'm just rambling. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, thank you for watching my video and, um, I will talk to y'all later. Bye.